In this reaction, we're adding copper metal to nitric acid, and we're using concentrated nitric acid. That's the equation that we're balancing here. If you use dilute nitric acid, you'll have a different set of coefficients. So we take the copper, and we add it to the nitric acid, and we get this copper 2 nitrate, nitrogen dioxide, and water. This is a bit of a challenging equation to balance. It took me a few times till I figured it out, and this is the solution that I came up with. So let's count up all the coefficients here. And the thing to watch out for here on the product side of the equation, we have 2 times the 1, that's 2 nitrogens plus this 1 here. That gives us 3 oxygens. 2 times 3 is 6, 7, 8, 9. So we have our coefficients. The first thing I'd like to do is get these hydrogens here to be balanced, because I could just put a 2 in front of the NO3, have 1 times 2. That'd give me 2 hydrogens, nitrogens 1 times 2. I get 2 of those and then oxygen, the 3 times the 2, I have 6 oxygens. And right away I realized that I have 6 oxygens here and 9 here, and then 2 nitrogens, 3 nitrogens. That's not going to work. It's going to have to be larger than 2. So I tried some different things, but eventually I figured I'll just double this, and then that will get my oxygens in a state that hopefully I can balance them on the other side. So instead of 2, I'll put 4 right here. When I do that, I need to update these numbers. So now I've updated the numbers here, and I can see that I have 3 nitrogens, 4 here, 9 oxygens, and 12. And I think what would be good to do is to fix the nitrogens. So if I put a 2 in front of the NO2, that would mean that I'd have the 2 nitrogens plus the 2 nitrogens. That would give me 4. And then for the oxygens, I have 2 times 3 is 6, plus 2 times 2 is 4 plus the one oxygen here, and now I realize that I have the two hydrogens here, and I have four over here. I didn't balance my hydrogens, so I'm going to do that right now. I'm going to put a two in front of the hydrogens, two times two. That equals four. So when I do the last oxygens here, I have one times the two instead of that one I had. That's two. And 10, 12, that'll give me 12. So those are the coefficients. That's how I solved that. And I forgot to do my hydrogen, but I caught myself as I came towards the end. I saw I had only two hydrogens here. And it's a bit of a challenge equation again, but um, that's how I solved it. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for copper plus nitric acid. And thanks for watching.